these are the characters that are available to us in many, many, many of the movies. So it's kind of interesting to think, you know, where we fit in those. And also, how it's not so much even how we see how we fit, it's how other people see how we fit. Right? Because that's what we're giving off, and we'll talk about that a little later. Okay? All right, now, I'm, I'm laying groundwork here. I really am. Like Andre was saying, right? I'm not a crazy American. He's not a crazy Russian. I'm not a crazy American. We're laying groundwork. So, in the middle of the Atlantic Ocean here, right, we're going all the way back to Vaudeville, they had no microphones, right? But yet they were doing like eight shows a week. They were using their voices a lot, no microphones. They had to come up with a very relaxed, efficient way to speak English. Or they, were, or they would have very short careers, right? So they learned and they started to examine the English language and to say, all right, what's the most efficient way that we can speak these sounds? And they did it. And they basically examined it and they, they discovered that we've got three things to use, the jaw, the lips, and the tongue. And if, we, if we're very specific on which, which sounds require which positions, right, then we can be very efficient about it. That's how it that's how it was created, okay? And up until, really, you know, up until television kind of came along, every actor in Hollywood learned to speak in Atlantic. You guys know um, Catherine Hepburn? Mm -hmm. You can steal her here. Somebody just sent, was it you? No, who? who emailed, that was another student. Emailed me um, from her from, um, it's called the Philadelphia